very good morning students we have discussed about the water quality parameters water quality standards for domestic water supply with reference to aesthetic and health perception in the previous class today we are going to study and discuss about assessment of water quality in domestic water supply systems <coughs> to meet these aspects we have to provide the treatment facility consisting of collection works conveyance works treatment works and distribution work here what i want to emphasize is that necessity of assessment of water quality depends upon the degree and nature of treatment required to be given to the raw water depends upon the characteristics and quality of the raw water and also upon the quality requirement for the intended use here the intended use is domestic purpose isn't it in that case so we have to design plan and design a treatment facility that treatment facility is consisting of collection works conveyance works and treatment works and distribution works if you go to the layout of the treatment plant here the collections works will be the part of the raw water sources a source of the water the lake rivers ponds reservoirs maybe and the conveyance works are nothing but the conduits or the pipes conveying the water from the raw that from the source to the treatment facility or we call them as water works treatment works here there is collection works these all are up to treatment they are called treatment works then comes again there will be a distribution work that is the network of pipes and conduits in the city or a town that is called as distribution network isn't it so in order to design these works facilities we need to have a monitoring assessment of water quality at the source after the treatment and in the distribution at the consumer point is essential for planning designing these works to function effectively and efficiently no if you come to the collection work collection works are nothing but the intake structures they are the built in the body of the water to draw water from the source their function is to provide highest quality of water from the source and to protect water pipes and pumps from damaging or clogging by wave action floating bodies and submerged here the importance uh, while designing intake structures from water quality point of view we have to consider the location with respect to source of pollution the frequency of floating matter such as ice and vegetation so if there is a high source of pollution we should locate our intake structure at the upstream side of the pollution source of pollution not at the downstream side of source of pollution so that we can get the very good raw water quality from the source then similarly conveyance works are two stages in transportation of water conveyance of water from the source to the treatment plant and conveyance of treated water from the treatment plant to the distribution system that is raw water to the treatment plant and treated water to the distribution network here the quality of water also plays a very important role in designing and planning the these conveyance works with reference to the quality of the raw water and also with reference to the quality of the treated water now in the treatment works we are having these are the units aeration unit screening chemical method softening sedimentation coagulation filtration disinfection these are the impurities they are going to remove in this so with these similarly in the distribution works the purpose of distribution system is to deliver water to the consumers with appropriate quality quantity and pressure and water quality should not get deteriorated in the distribution pipe pipes so overall what i want to emphasize in this lecture is how to design how to plan and design how to plan and design outcome and design the treatment plants with reference to its effective functioning 
So as I mentioned, the water available at the source is called raw water. Water available at the source is called raw water here. Yeah. We need to monitor and assess the quality of that water with reference to the nature and degree of treatment required to be given to the given at the treatment works. These are the treatment works. Then treated water, the raw water undergoing various treatment operations and process to bring all bring in all water quality, bring in all water quality parameters within the maximum parameter limit level or tolerable level or tolerable level. So that is to make this raw water to a potable water, to a potable water. To ascertain the function of each unit, units of treatment, suppose now here the treatment unit will be sedimentation, this is the coagulation unit, sedimentation unit, then filtration unit, these are the different units. So that means now if we want to assess, if we want to know whether these units are functioning properly, then we have to have a monitoring points both at the inlet, for example coagulation, at the inlet and also at the outlet. So now here we are in the coagulation unit, we are removing the colloidal particles, colloidal particles. Now if we know the concentration of the colloidal particles entering into the coagulation tank and then the leaving the coagulation tank that is going to give you the how the efficiency whether this plant is working with the design efficiency or not. So here the water quality parameters plays important role in the performance analysis of each and every individual units. Similarly in the distribution network the treated water to be supplied to the consumers through the network of pipes laid in towns and cities called distribution networks. The, there is a every possibility of cross contamination of treated water due to leakages, due to leakages in the distribution system. And if the if the distribution pipes are in parallel with the sewage line thereby treated water gets contaminated to identify the location of contamination identify the location of contamination we have to go for monitoring and assessment of water quality in the distribution network so overall the assessment of the water quality plays a very important role in supplying a potable water to the consumers so for their in protecting their health thank you